Ranking my horror story villains. Just know this is my opinion. In seventh place, we have the flea. So, they didn't really even do anything but look dumb. They aren't scary, and they just, honestly just look dumb, so it gets last. In sixth place, we have the Lost T-Rex. Again, this villain didn't really do anything at all besides kill the hunter off screen. Oop, that was kind of lame. My bad. In fifth place, we have Red and Blue. This villain was honestly pretty okay. But all they really did was kill the protagonist in the game, and that was a little boring. And it was just one still image. It wasn't even like a clip or anything, it was just one still image. So yeah, not my best. In fourth place, we have the Blue Chasmosaurus. They had a pretty solid story and a pretty solid kill with the hunter being crushed. But the scenes are kind of bland and can get confusing. In third place, we have the intruder. The mastermind behind the carnage virus, he has killed people brutally, but if I'm being honest, he's forgettable. As the monster in the game, basically the carnage monster, is way more popular and honestly is just way more rememberable than the actual person behind it. Sorry, guy. And in second place, we have the Carnage Monster. Where do I even start? This guy is a legend. Amazing. I'm so glad to be the creator of this guy. He has a great story and an amazing character. In first place, we have Nathan Spider. Even though this is a newcomer to the channel, I definitely won't make less than one video for them. The villain is amazing and has some awesome kills, dude. Well, that's the end. Bye!